Hello and welcome to some more Super Mario Maker 2. So, what we are going to be doing today is we are going to start a new Super World. This is Super Classic SMW World. I believe that this is a fully Super Mario World style Super World. The reason why I want to check it out is... I can't remember how this happened, but I believe I just came across maybe a trailer or something for this world. Um, I guess it was the creator of this super world that created a whole trailer for it. And then as I dove even deeper into it, they created a whole website with like a backstory to this world. And they just like, they put a ton of effort. There was like a lot of lore and stuff in it. It was super interesting to me. Um, the fact that somebody would put that much effort into their super world that I thought what the heck let's check it out even though I'm not necessarily the biggest fan of Super Mario Maker as like a game style um, but I still wanted to check this out it seemed really cool really interesting the amount of effort that they put into it so let's see how it goes if you've never been to my channel before, please consider subscribing. Also, leave a like on the video, leave a comment if you do enjoy it. Um, yeah, all the support definitely helps. It makes me want to keep making these videos, so... Oh, you sneaky little plant, you. <laughs> um, yeah, all of the support, all of the subscribes, all of the likes and the comments... They really mean a lot to me, so thank you again for taking the time to comment, for leaving a like, for all of that. I really appreciate it. Bring a Koopa shell with you? Why? I've got a pal right here. Now I believe every level has three big coins that increase in value. I, through all of my talking, I do not remember if I got the 10 coin. I did get the 30 and the 50 coin though. I think the 10 coin was up the vine now that I think about it. So you can see that the world, at least from the first level, has a very sort of traditional feel to it. Lots of stuff to explore, which I always love. I don't know difficulty wise how it's going to be, but um, eh, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Kinoko Island Tool. Two. <laughs> tool. Wow. Apparently I can no longer read like I used to. Was not expecting that to happen. Ten coin. Okay, so I can land there. just realized that for the past minute <laughs> my microphone was muted so everything I said has been lost for the ages. Really what I was talking about was my companion Goomba that um, decided to let me down, decided to bite the hand that feeds him.
And quite frankly, I didn't appreciate that. You know, I'm, I think I might... I decided to use my fireballs to get my revenge on all of them. So you can see again, another very traditional level. Very nice, easy going, not too difficult. I think I'm also going to include a link to the website that the creator made. I'm going to leave it in the comments too. I encourage you to check it out and see just the amount of effort that they put into this super world as a whole. Darn fish. Oh, I hate when the comments block the platforms. Ooh, hello. There's gotta be a coin up there, right? But how would we get up there? How do you get up there? Ah, oh, ho, ho, there we go. You're making me go back a long way for this 10 coin. At least there's a pipe here. <laughs> Where's Yoshi? The age old question. got that last one. Now, did we miss any coins along the way? Well, I guess we don't have time to find out. Hopefully not. Hmm, another pipe there. Well, I missed a lot of coins. What's up with that? I think I only found the one, didn't I? That's okay. I guess it's okay to leave one behind. Or two. Again, I really wish that Mario Maker had a feature like um, in New Super Mario Bros. U or something like that that kept track of big coins and collecting them and stuff like that. Would be nice. Maybe in Mario Maker 3 if there's ever a Mario Maker 3. I want to see if there's anything down there, but I'm scared, <laughs> but now I know there isn't. Oh, how did I miss that? Oh my goodness. Here we go, take three. Oh my gosh. There we go.
Oh my god, all I can do is face palm at, uh, at how terrible I'm doing at this level. At least hit the checkpoint next time, man. Please. Oh, thank goodness. Oops. Give me a flower, give me something. How come we haven't seen the feather yet? <laughs> my pipe. Hello. Yoink. Got me a 30 coin. I'm $30 richer. Now where's the 50 coin? I found it. There we go. Alright, well, we just have one level to go. Just the castle. And again, I believe it is, like, just a traditional style of castle, so... Gonna have one of the Koopalings as the boss. It's gonna be a good time. Ow. Slow and steady. Patience is a virtue. Ooh, that was close. Didn't find any star coins there. Unless it was down like one of those gaps. Yep, we definitely missed the 10 coin. Those, these coins here are very misleading, because it makes you want to go over there. Like, usually the coins indicate a path and not um, leading you to certain death and doom and gloom. Know what I mean? Know what I mean, Jelly Bean? See, those ones did. Gimme coins. All the coins. Extra life. And there's old Fitty. Old Fitty scent. Ow. Oh, let's just do this. Hopefully there's an item or something here. Perfect. Ow. Ow. I'm scared. 
There we go. That was actually pretty easy enough. I thought it would be difficult with the skewers and the fireballs, but it really was not too bad at all. Yay! We rescued Yoshi. Alright, well that is going to do it for World 1 of this classic SMW world. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, leave a comment, consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. We are going to check out World 2 in the next video, but until then, have a good one and I'll talk to you later.